Having spent a few days now filled with photographic tips from Rick Salmon, my head was spinning. It was time for me to sit back and just enjoy the sights. But Rick, Rick just keeps on teaching. You know, so many photographers, when they see a scene, you know, they just shoot and then move on. Mm -hmm. If they just, you know, crouch down, move to the left, move to the right, you know, that changes the scene so mm -hmm. much. You really have to, you know, take your time, mm -hmm. look at the whole scene. And uh, again, I think here, getting down, shooting through the grasses, would be uh, a very, very nice picture. Yeah. Yeah, one thing, if I've learned anything, patience certainly is, uh, does pay off here. Well, patience and being there. Mm -hmm. You know, you really do need a great subject to get a great photograph. And I think here in Botswana, we've seen so many mm. great subjects. Giraffe, lion, zebra. Great shot of the back of that giraffe. <laughs> Another butt shot. The one thing that I have learned from this entire African experience is that I will always be an amateur photographer and Rick is a professional photographer. Because you see, the proof is in the pudding. This is Rick's shot, and this is mine. This is Rick's shot, and this is mine. Rick's shot, and mine. Luckily, I had one more stop on my African adventure to improve my technique. 